Hello, it's the Crap Goth. My name is Pixie and welcome to my channel of randomness where you never know what you're gonna get. And today is another unboxing video, which is absolutely brilliant and it's nearly one o'clock in the morning so I really should keep my gob shut a little bit. Before I start on anything, I want to say a huge thank you to everybody who still continues to contact me across different social media platforms. It is amazing to talk to you all. I love to hear messages. Um, I love because you send voice messages and text messages and picture messages and funny memes and inappropriate memes, which are really, really funny. I have a Facebook page, which is The Crap Goth, which I'm on pretty much daily. So if you want to talk to me, come and have a chat on there. But if you're a dick, I will kick you straight back off again. So be nice, play nice. But yes, today is just a little unboxing video. It's not a big one. And it's just um, a few things which have come from the PO box and the Amazon list, I think, because they're all in Amazon boxes. So for those of you who are new to the channel, um, we have a PO box which runs across two different YouTube stations, channels even. That's mine, which is the Crap Goth, and my little boys, which is Crack in the Box, which I will link up to, to the description of this video. And on the Amazon wish list, we don't just put things on for ourselves for unboxing videos. We also do put things on for charity, which goes under the community project and then crewmates for Christmas when we've gone on run up to the festive season. I'm just stumbling over my words today. So please be assured that um, if you see something which is on the list and it says the community project that is going to be donated to hospitals, hospices, schools, local groups in the area, families in need and just generally people who really do appreciate and need these things. So thank you for helping us to help others. That really does mean a lot. And I'm going to crack on with what I've got down here. So thank you all so much for making another video like this possible and if you've not already subscribed please do subscribe to this channel because it helps hugely. Tick that little bell icon to make sure you get all the notifications when a new video goes up and do feel free to comment down below as well like I love to talk to people. So right I'm going to crack on and see what is down here because I'm so excited and I'm also very tired and I'm looking very very old today. So yes excuse my red eyes and my oldness and hopefully you enjoy the video. Okay, so I have got a few things down here. Um, I've already opened a, a couple of packages. Oh, 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 I swear to God, this video is going to be shit because I can't even speak. I've already opened a couple of the things up, but I haven't looked inside. It just makes the process a little bit quicker. Um, most things have come from Amazon. They have the big Amazon smile on the boxes, which is really cool. There are a couple of packets, and I have this. Uh, oh, one of them is to the PO box, which is so super exciting. I love it when I get things that say the crap goth, and it's from the PO box because I just literally have no clue what is inside or even who it's for it could be for any member of my family which is really cool so I'm going to shut up and get started so the first one we have is this one here I will also let you know that sometimes I order things from TikTok and totally forget so I end up buying myself a present which is always quite a nice surprise but this one is actually to my name to my name of course it's to my name it's to my address seriously should I stop now <laughs> You can tell it's one in the morning, and just so you guys know, if you see my videos and go, she's wearing the same thing, the dirty cow, I literally have been filming for like six hours. <laughs> so I've done video after video after video, and I've still got another video to do after this one for my son's channel. So I'm filming for two YouTube channels at the moment, and I do it for hours at a time. So I do actually get changed. I'm just filming one after the other. Okay, so this one has come to my home address and it is a cardboard box. Oh, it looks as though it's open a little bit, so hopefully it's okay. And oh my gosh, so it is quite a bit open. I'm hoping everything's all right. That's a plastic bit, which looks like it could be something for the garden, which is cool. And we have here, I think it's something which is solar powered. Oh my god, this is so cool! Right, I would like to say also really, really quickly um, that I get a lot of messages from people who have said, we've, we've ordered this for you, we've ordered this for you, it can't come with notes. And I have to honestly say that I don't ever remember or very rarely remember um, who each individual person is. So I am really sorry if you've sent something and you're like, but I told her I'd sent it and I don't remember. It's just because I have so many people message me. It's almost impossible to keep up with everything unless I'm writing notes down. And even then I'd have to sit with a book and I'd have to be looking at every page and trying to scan everything. So I just... 
if you see something you've bought and and there is no note with it like this here there is no note with this one please do comment down below um or message me or something just so i know it's from you so i can say thank you because um yeah i just won't remember <laughs> i'm so sorry it just i just won't so this is i know what this is i can see it, it looks so cool so this is a solar parrot now oh my gosh I can hear something inside, so I hope it's okay. But this actually comes with the little stake which goes into the floor, which is really cool. The solar panel there. Now this will fix into, there is a little light in there, and that will fix into the bottom of the parrot. And then there'll be lots of these connecting pipes, which will make, give obviously give the parrot height. This is for Captain Corey's resting place. And it might be circulated then onto his memorial garden once that's done. But we will take this to Captain Curry's resting place because it's literally just behind where we live. He has a beautiful, beautiful burial spot, which um, we try and keep really colourful and really highly decorated. And with lots of pirate things and artificial flowers and solar lights and everything. So if you guys want to send anything at all to Captain Corey please do feel free um anything which is addressed to Corey will go um onto crack in the box which is his youtube channel and anything which is addressed to me will come obviously and um, be opened on the crap goth but i will always make sure everything goes to the relevant places regardless of where anything is is it actually addressed to so if you're not familiar with Corey's backstory please do go and look at the previous videos on both crack in the box which i will link up to the description of this video and also my previous videos because if i go into it now i'm going to be crying all night but this is my beautiful, beautiful, beautiful boy, Corey, and um, he gained his wings last July. And um, yeah, he is just, oh God, I love him so much. I miss him. And this is a beautiful, beautiful present for him. So whoever sent this, because there is no note with this one, thank you so, so much. And I do apologise for the things next to me. Like I said, I've just done another unboxing video, so I actually still have some remnants from the last one. Sorry. But this is beautiful. Just look at that. How cute is he? every pirate needs a parrot he is beautiful so thank you so much to whoever thought to send that to Corey honestly that's a lovely present thank you so so much I really do appreciate it thank you this ring light keeps going dark and light by the way I don't quite know why <laughs> but when it goes bright I look very youthful for my 44 years so I prefer it <laughs> okay this next one ah, this one is two Pixie Winter Travers Stavell and it's come to my home address so it's somebody who knows where I live and already I can see a little ribbon sticking out which means it's a gift bag which is super exciting oh I love that it's so satisfactory about you know when it rips off in one piece I bloody love it you know when it bits and bobs I get so frustrated it's like oh my god oh gift bags were one of Corey's favourite things to get as well because like we literally never know what's in them which is so exciting so thank you so much to everybody who sends things honestly you are absolute superstars and without you guys being so generous and absolutely amazing videos like this just wouldn't be possible so thank you so much and Corey's there smiling away knowing that it's true honestly you're all amazing so there is the letter which comes with all of the parcels, but hopefully there'll be a tag on it, which there is. I always say these, I say it in every video, every single parcel that's come into this house, both for Corey and myself over the past year or so, or every single parcel, I've kept all of these tags. We've got hundreds of them. Okay, so this says, hi, Bab, <laughs> or oh, straight away, I know that is from Miranda instantly because she's the only one who calls me Bab because she's from Birmingham. So, hi, Bab, just got these. Um, Ostar as well is the parrot, the pirate flag. Oh my gosh, so the parrot just now is from Miranda. So thank you so much. Love you all bundles and sending you massive rummy hugs, Pixie, from Miranda Stokes G. Oh my god, thank you so this parrot is from you as well. Thank you so much. And the wellies for Ostara. So I do put things on the Amazon wish list for both um, my family, myself for unboxing videos, and like I said, also for charity as well. So, but there is no obligation for anybody to ever, ever, ever buy anything at all. Just messages to say hi are more than enough, and they're gifts to themselves, honestly. Like, like we really do love hearing from people so please don't ever feel you need to send anything and if you ever want to shout out message me on facebook like i said the crap goth is my page uh, i will write it down and give you a shout out as well and i do birthday shout outs and everything so just let me know what you want to do i'll sing to you i can't sing for shit but i give it a go yeah just give me a shout i'm pretty much a nice person most of the time um a bit foul mouth though so if your granny's watching you might want to tell her to turn off okay so oh my 
my gosh, we have some things for Corey's resting place. So there is loads and loads of butter. I think it's like 50 or something. Like loads and loads and loads of butterflies. Oh my gosh. So these are beautiful. We actually have some of these with Corey at the moment. And you, they, they have the really long metal stakes that go into the ground. And the butterflies open up. And these have lasted the winter. A couple of them have lost the wings, but most of them are so heavy duty, they're fantastic. So what we're going to do is we're literally going to split this in half and a whole portion of them will be set aside for Corey's resting place, which we'll just replace them whenever they start to wear out. And the other lot will go here into the memorial garden once that's done as well. So, oh my goodness, just look at those. They are so pretty and they come on little springs as well so they kind of move in the wind and flap which is so pretty. I might give Astara a couple of pink ones for her bedroom window actually because she's just had her bedroom decorated if that's okay because I think that she would really appreciate that. But oh my gosh they are gorgeous. Thank you so much. I love it when people send things for Corey's resting place. Honestly it is so nice. Thank you. It helps to keep it looking beautiful and I do post photos of it as well on, on, on Facebook so you know so, so people can see where the gifts are going so Thank you so much. And also on TikTok, we do actually go and visit Corey and we do TikToks of, of his resting place because he's a YouTuber at the end of the day. This is his life. So just because he's grown his wings does not mean we're going to stop keeping him in the public eye. We will always keep his channel going. So thank you so much, Miranda. They are beautiful. I really appreciate that. Thank you so very much. And as the night goes on, I'm going to start looking so bad. I'm so sorry. Oh my gosh. So we have another Amazon here, which is great. And this is to Princess Ostara. Now, I pre-opened this one already, but um, anything which is gifted to Ostara, I always show on camera. So if you guys send anything, I will always open it on camera, whether it's a full YouTube video, if it's something like a plant or a tree for the garden, for the memorial garden, it could be on TikTok. But it, TikToks always end up on YouTube anyway. So, yeah, just just please know whatever you send will always be sent. So always be shown even. So things for Ostara and everything, I open them on camera, but then I put them back in the packaging and give them to her when she finishes school. Obviously, it's almost one o'clock in the morning. It is one o'clock in the morning. Um, so she'll have this after school. And this, has he got a note with it? Um, yes, there is a note with it. This is from, oh, a gift from Skylar and Celeste. We hope you like your gift, Ostara. Lots of love from across the pond from Skylar and Celeste. So they are Alicia's girls. So hi, girls. Are you OK? Thank you so much for this. They are beautiful. They live in America and they've become friends of ours, which is incredible. And this looks to be like a unicorn plaque that I put on the on the list. So Ostara has just had her bedroom decorated. So Corey, um, my beautiful boy there, um, and Ostara shared a big bedroom, but we but we actually built a dividing wall to kind of separate it into two smaller bedrooms. And then when Corey became unable to use the stairs, we actually brought him downstairs, converted the dining room into his bedroom. And then when Corey passed away, um, he knew it was going to happen and he was happy for his, for his sister. We actually just, we've just converted the bedroom back into one big bedroom for Stara so she can have friends over for the first time ever because we couldn't risk Corey's health before. So we've just decorated it all princessy and unicorns and pink. So I've been putting things on the list for her bedroom. And this is a beautiful sign for her. So this says, dance with fairies, swim with mermaids, ride a unicorn, chase rainbows. And actually rainbows are really significant because Corey went to Rainbow Children's Hospice in Loughborough and we just love rainbows as well. So like we tend to keep a lot of rainbows around the house as well. So this is beautiful. Just look at that. It's so pretty. Oh my gosh. Oh, she's going to absolutely love that. Thank you so much. And it comes with a piece of string in there, look. But I'm going to pop this back into the packaging so that she gets to open it herself tomorrow. Well, today, after school, should I say. And, um, yeah, thank you. Honestly, thank you so much for sending things for us, Sarah, because she has had so much for her bedroom because of you guys. And it is so pretty. Like, we don't have a lot of money as a family. Um, so things like this really, really help us out. They make her happy. It's amazing content for the YouTube stations as well. Channels, even. I keep calling them stations. Channels. So thank you guys so much. And thank you, girls. Big, 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 big pirate hogs. Okay. Right, I don't know if you just heard, there's a little squeak then. My chihuahua is playing with his toys. He's doing it again. But oh, Sarah's in bed. He keeps squeaking his toys. Alicia, this is your fault. You sent these toys. I'm going to have to go and just take it off my chihuahua two seconds. <sighs> Sorry about that. Alicia bought, um, on one of my unboxing videos, I unboxed these little tiny squeaky balls for the chihuahua that I've got. 
and he absolutely bloody loves them and he squeaks them at the most inappropriate of times like when I'm filming or when it's one o'clock in the morning and I'm is in bed and I'm, I feel guilty taking his toys off him but I'm like go to bed go to bed spooky so it's your fault Alicia it's your fault your my dog is keeping us all awake but honestly oh my gosh it makes me giggle so much he's so inconveniencing at times but he's cute as fuck okay so the next one is this one here and it is my full name pixie winter travis devel and like I, I don't know if i've just said this on this video because i've done that i've been filming for hours saying the same thing on a lot of videos but i actually buy things on tiktok myself and sometimes forget so i open something i'm like that looks familiar and it's like oh it's a present from pixie to pixie because i'm a dickhead and i forget oh, no it's a gift bag it's something I don't know what it is then that's really cool oh my goodness it's exciting little envelope and little label which is really cool so this is oh a Miranda again wow I've just done an unboxing video and you've gifted on that as well hi Bab sent with lots of love and massive brummy hugs from Miranda Stokes G oh thank you so much Miranda I will message you obviously after this unboxing just so you know that I've got the things you've sent thank you <laughs> so much can't open the bag i'm 44 and i can't open a bag these ribbons by the way look they're gothy and so cool i really like them oh just so you guys know as well so we tend to keep to keep the bigger bags but the, these smaller bags here are actually fully recyclable as well and we as long as you take out the ribbons you can recycle the bags and it's great because we get to keep the ribbons for crafts which is which i always do that oh this is a book by, by the looks of it. Oh my God, fantastic. Thank you so, so, so much. This is brilliant. So this is actually really cool. How to start a charity. So, oh my gosh, if you're considering starting a charity, um, or sorry, a new charitable organisation, then this book is for you. So for anybody who is new to this channel, um, I am literally in the middle of setting up a charity called the Captain Corey Foundation. Now, Captain Corey is this beautiful boy behind me here who was pirate obsessed. So there's a lot of backstories. Please go back and look on the channels. And it is so fucking hard to set up a charity people just think it's a case of applying and you get a charity number and then you can start raising money it is not like that at all there is so much red tape there's so much legalities there's so much paperwork to fill in you've got to submit submit manifestos to people and everything honestly like predicted outcomes what you want to do the goals everything it's a really really hard thing to do and we are literally in the middle of doing it ourselves now, um, at the moment, although there is um, a GoFundMe, which was set up um, when Corey passed away, and that is what we're going to be using to launch the foundation, um, we're actually doing the, uh, the the memorial garden, we're finishing off the YouTube studio, and then we're going to launch the charity as much as we can. So, yeah, honestly, any help at all with anybody who has experience with starting a charity and things like this... Thank you so much because we are literally on our own with this. Like we don't really know what it is we're doing. We're reading all of the government guidelines and doing it properly, but it's taking time. So please do be patient with us. But meanwhile, behind all of the scenes, and we don't really make a big deal of it because we're not really wanting to be like glory hunters. We are still doing a lot of charity work anyway. We're making regular donations, uh, both monetary and physical items to a lot of people. We help families every week. We dedicate a certain amount of hours every single week without fail to talking to families, sometimes until the early hours of the morning and through the night, depending on what part of the world they're from, helping them with um, the same scenario that we've been through. So if they have a child in palliative care, they're feeling a bit tearful, they want some advice, then I sit up with them and I literally talk to them all night. So there is a lot of things going on behind the scenes as though the foundation were up and running. We just need to get the legal side sorted. So Miranda, thank you so, so much for this. I will sit down and read this and this will be invaluable. So thank you so much, you absolute legend. Thank you. <laughs> okay, so the next one is... I'm leaving my crap goth one till last because I want to know what it is. But it's like, oh, it's my YouTube one. So this one is in a very pretty colour bag, I like, I like the colours, pink's my favourite colour because I am a crap goth. This is, oh this says Pixie Faye Winters Travis Devel, which makes me think it's Frostara because Ostara's middle name is Faye, F-A-E, like a fairy. Um, so yeah, I think this might be for Ostara but I'm going to open it anyway. Why is the ring light gone so dark? 
Lumos. There we go. Okay. God, this is really well wrapped. I think I've got some scissors. Oh, something rainbow colored in there by the looks of it. Oh, it is, it's a rain. I can see a rainbow, which is cool. These are like the bluntest scissors in the history of the fucking world. They're rubbish. I think they're meant to be kitchen scissors, but they're dead blunt. Oh my gosh, what is this? Oh, it looks like they might make some wall decals, maybe. Oh my gosh, okay, wow. Several things in this bag. Oh my god, who is this from? Wow, there's quite a few items in this bag here. I don't know who they're from. Okay, so first of all, we have a beautiful rainbow wall decal, which is so nice. Oh my God, it glows in the dark. It says here, you can um, light it for half an hour, turn off the light and it shines in the dark. Oh my God, let's just hold it up. I'm just gonna hold it up to the ring light just for like a couple of like, for like a minute and see if it works because oh my, things like this are so awesome. Thank you so, so, so much. In fact, I'm not gonna give it a full minute because it's not fair to make you guys wait, but let's quickly flick off the ring light and see if it works. Yay! That glows really well. Oh my gosh. I'm blind! Honestly, thank you so much. That is really, really nice. So our Star Wars room has now been decorated for about two, three months. So we're actually able to put decals on the wall now because you have to give the paint a bit of time to go off. So thank you so much for that one. It's still glowing up, which is really cool. Oh my God, that's so funky. And we have a bag of items here and then something in cardboard, which is really, really cool. So we have, oh my gosh, rainbow stickers, which I'm not gonna open because these are for Ostara. So lots and lots and lots of rainbow stickers, which is really sweet. Stickers everywhere. She absolutely bloody loves stickers, which is amazing. Thank you so much. There is also, oh my gosh, oh my God. I think these might be for me actually, because these are little purple bat lights. Look at those. Oh my God, they're adorable. So the battery lights, which is great if you have a power cut, it's fantastic. I'm sure they're mine because I don't think Osara likes that. So they are so cool. Thank you so much to whoever bought those. Wow, they are cute. And we have some green stuff. Now this looks as though, I bet that's glow in the dark. Do you reckon that's glow in the dark? I'll hold it up against the ring light for a minute while I just, And there is some, oh, these are unicorn stickers as well. I just saw like, like a little horn there, look. So unicorn stickers for Ostara. See if these glow in the dark on the off chance. Oh my god! So, um, I've actually been gifted things like this before from from Anne Marie. So I wonder if these are from Anne Marie. I don't know because we can use things like this in jars at Corey's resting place, and it looks so nice at night time when, when things start they start to light up. I wonder if this is what it's for. Is this for Corey? Can you comment down below if this is from you, please? This is really really cool. Yeah, if you see anything and it's definitely from, from, from anybody and they've not put a note in, please do feel free to comment, honestly, because it's just, I always love to say thank you for things. And it can be really frustrating if someone sent something and they're there going, it's from me. And, and I've already recorded the video like two weeks ago. So yeah, oh my gosh. Oh, there's a love heart there. Oh, I'm going to cut that open because it's a really fancy bag actually. Oh, so this looks really, really nice. It looks like it's a wood effect, but it's, it's. I think it's a uh, rack of plastic. Oh, right, so it's, oh, it can be read in the mirror because it's back to front. So there we go. So I can't read it this way around. So what does that say? It says, um, from our first kiss till our last, our last breath. Oh, that is so lovely. That is beautiful. Oh, it's wood and it, the holding hands look. That is so pretty, oh my gosh. And it's made out of an acrylic, which is really, really nice. Oh, thank you so much. That is really, really pretty and very, very sentimental as well. Thank you. And there is another packet of the glow in the dark green things as well, the crystal also. Thank you so much for that. Whoever sent that, I, I have a feeling it might be Anne-Marie, but I really don't know. And then we have this big one here. Oh. Oh my gosh, so I think this is like a cardboard sleeve and there's something in there. So I'm being really careful how I open this. Oh, don't want to damage anything. Please be careful with scissors if this kid's watching. And this is, oh. This 
It's <laughs> this is the fluffy butt hut. Can you? I don't know if you can see that very well because of the. Oh, what can I hold it against? Can I hold it against? That's not exactly. There we go. Look. The fluffy butt hut. So for those of you who don't know, we keep chickens. So we have chickens on the garden. We have beehives. We we did have turkeys until recently, but the little fuckers kept escaping. Like they were literally jumping up onto next door's conservatory and then jumping across the garage roof. And they're like, if they get onto the road, they're going to cause an accident because turkeys are huge. So they ended up having to go and live on a farm. <laughs> but yeah, we have chickens. So this is going to be great for the eco garden. I love that. The fluffy butt hut. And it's made out of quite thick metal. That's actually really, really cool. So that is going to go out in the memorial garden in the eco section, which is going to be dedicated to my little boy, Corey. So, oh my God, thank you so much. Just look at that, look. It's really good quality as well. That's really nice. And it comes with pre-drilled holes, which is always good. Thank you so, so much to whoever has sent these. Absolute legends. I'm going to hopefully find out who that's from. But yeah, like I said, if anything is from you and there's no notes, please do comment down in the section, like down here, because that'll be awesome to say thank you. Right, okay, we don't actually have that many more to do now. Um, this one is to, oh my gosh, it's the P.O. Box. I love the P.O. Box ones because I never know what they are. Uh, it's Amazon, which is exciting. Oh, it ripped first time. Ooh, books. <gasps> Oh my god it's a book 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 so this is oh my gosh this says a gift for you i wanted to send this to you and it was the most inexpensive way i hope you like it we'll talk privately about what inspired this story from miranda gargasks oh my god that is so cool ah i got a book which is amazing oh my gosh haunting suspicion of a, a valerie calhoun mystery Oh my gosh, so this is uh, Miranda Gargas, I probably said your name wrong, is a freelance writer. She is currently working on her second noggle, no, noggle? <laughs> novel, Dragonfly, about learning to love what you've lost. Oh my God, I can't speak today. About learning to love what you have before it's gone. Oh my gosh. And this is so true. Our lives can change suddenly because of those around us, both living and dead. And my little boy died so quickly. So, like, I, yeah, I, I will... I will read this when I when I feel definitely when I feel ready. But oh my gosh, thank you so much! Wow, I love getting books. Thank you so much for that, Miranda. Honestly, my gosh, thank you so so much. Oh, I love that. I love books, and I've just got some new bookshelves in my bedroom. So I'm gonna take that upstairs my bedroom tonight. Thank you so much. I'll drop you a message after. Thank you. Oh, bless you. This one is a P.O. Box one also. Thank you. Sorry if I seem I'm going through this a little bit quick, but it's re getting really, really, really early hours of the morning and I've still got to film for Crack in the Box. Oh, wow. Okay, so we have... That was very high-pitched then. Oh, wow. This is... Oh, the same person from Miranda. How do you say your name? So, a gift from Miranda Gar... Is it, so, Gargasks. So S and a Z. How do you say that? I'm not very good at surnames. Um... These and the buttercup seeds that will arrive soon are for Corey's garden. Much love to you and the family from Miranda. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, for me and my family. Um, oh, buttercup seeds, buttercups are so spiritually significant for Corey and I. So, oh my God, thank you so much. Oh. So these are um, Anne, Ma Anne Madada Citradora. And they are, oh, bergamo, bergamot, I can't even pronounce flower names, lilac, <laughs> basically, yeah, then you can read it yourself because I'm rubbish at this. Oh my gosh, honestly, things like this are fantastic. Thank you so much. So we absolutely adore getting things for the garden. So obviously we're setting up a memorial garden for Corey, which is going to be a working eco garden. Um, so we have been gifted trees, plants, bushes, wind chimes, um, what else have we had? We've had, um, I can't, obviously seeds, both vegetable and plant, um, which is incredible, like flowers. Um, we've had plant pots, um, solar lights, all sorts, literally all sorts of things. Oh, a bridge, we got gifted a bridge, a wishing well, some garden gnomes, and oh my gosh, honestly, 
anything for the garden is amazing so thank you and people are even sending us um they are decorating stones and they're putting little messages on to corey and then you can send them to us unsealed and then and we will actually put them um cover them in yacht varnish and put them outside so yeah so so we're going to do a rock river full of messages from all from all around the world so if you guys want to send anything like that please feel free as well thank you so much for this this is beautiful oh my goodness thank you ever such a lot it means a lot thank you right okay then this says next day delivery so i'm thinking is this something that i've ordered um this is oh this i would say it feels like shoes i think it might be the wellies that miranda has just said um brummy miranda so these are two they're, they're, they're just for me but it says it's shoes only which makes me think it is the wellies for ostara yes it is oh my gosh so i put wellies on oh, that is so they smell like cannabis honestly it's the kind i don't know it's like a how it's so weird they literally legitimately smell like weed it's the plastic there's no weed in there i promise you but they do that that first initial like they smell like weed oh my god why, where, where are shoes i'm getting their things from so these are wellies for star i'm gonna open you to show you so it's given it out to be quite rainy um we're in the uk it rains all the fucking time like it's terrible and um being completely honest um i couldn't afford to buy ostara any wellies because i've just paid out a lot of money for bills and everything else and i thought i'll pop us on wellies on the amazon wish list because nobody has any 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 obligation to buy at all but i have so many requests to put things on for, for ostara and she has a room full of toys so i thought i may as well put something practical on little mermaid wellies just look at those and they're glittery look and they have this little bit at the top which is great because when it's raining you can just pull the toggle and it pulls it tight against, against the legs to stop the rain from going down there but uh, these are a little bit big for her because she can wear fluffy socks underneath but it means we can go for like go for stomping and puddles we can go for walks through the woods and all that kind of stuff so this is going to be amazing so obviously there's two there's two of them but yeah and these are from miranda so thank you so much like oh my gosh and they don't smell of weed now i've got them out <laughs> which is cool they are really pretty oh my gosh thank you so 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 much for that honestly things like this are so appreciated because honestly like i said ostara has lots of toys it's not long been christmas people gift to things from all across the world but practical things are so helpful honestly thank you so so much for that she'll be one excited little girl when she comes home from school tomorrow thank you okay i have Oh, okay. I have a letter here from Alicia Hassinger. It's quite a thick letter and I don't know if I'm okay to read it on camera. So I'm going to leave that for another video. I'll message her, find out if I'm okay to read it. If I am, I'll read it on a different video. And um, if not, then it just won't, it won't appear on a video at all. Because I don't know if it's a personal thing or not. Right, okay. So the next thing I have is something which is addressed to me. And it's in a little packet, so I'm going to open it very carefully. I don't want to make sure there's nothing there some things i open beforehand some things i don't if it's small packets i tend not to and this is oh, oh yes this is for spanky oh my god okay so this is something that i actually ordered online for spanky so i thought it was going to come in a presentation box which is a little bit dis disappointing because it wasn't super expensive but what the way they showed it came in a display box and everything and it hasn't so this is basically a keyring, but it's made. So this is made in Russia, recycled in Ukraine. Never forgive, never forget. This is actually made from a tank, a Russian tank. They've, I don't know, they've nicked the tank and they've made keyrings out of them to raise money to help people. So this is why I bought it. And I showed it to Spanky. He's like, oh my God, he happened to say I'd love one of these. So as soon as I got paid, I went and bought, and like, like ordered him one. This was weeks ago. They take taken weeks to arrive. But there we go. So it is a keyring made from a Russian tank. There we go. I don't like war. I don't condone war. And I don't like people being hurt. And this is just like something that's really cool. It's recycled. And yeah, so there we go. And it's so cool. So this is a 37, um, 37 Motorized Rifle Brigade Russian Federation Military Unit Number 51460. There we go. That was the original Russian tank battle um original piece of russian tank skin there we go so that's what this is and this is for spanky bought just for those people who are looking to buy these on on facebook 
Um, I mean, it's very good. It looks like it's, it's it's really good quality, but they do show it in a presentation box, and clearly you don't get that. It came in a packet, so just be aware before you buy it. But if it's to help people, then I'm all for it. So yeah, hopefully he'll like it. He's asleep in the carriage at the moment. Right then, next one. We've not got many more. I think I think we've only got two. No, we've got three more to go, and that, and then that's it. The end of the video. So this one is, oh, it's a P.O. Box one. It's a P.O. Box one. Oh, it's Timu. Oh, I freaking love Timu parcels. Honestly, I get so excited. I don't personally order from Timu. I've never ordered from Timu before. Um, but everything which has been gifted to me, I know some people have an issue with it. Um, but everything which has been gifted to me and the family have been really cool items. I shop at Shein a lot because that's what I can afford to do. I don't have the luxury of being able to afford to shop anywhere else. I don't condone child labour and all that kind of stuff. So please don't judge me or anything like that. But um, yeah, I, I, I've I never had any issues with these at all. Timu have always been amazing. Oh my God, there is so much in here. Wow. Now, depending on what, in it, what is in here, I might have an idea who it's from. So the two people who usually send me Timu things, this I'm not saying it is from them, but it's usually the old part from Canada or Anne-Marie from Wales. So I'm not sure if it's either one of those two, but we have some, oh my gosh. So there's some wind spinners. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight wind spinners which makes me think these are potentially to donate out because we tend to donate things like this to the rainbows children's hospice and things like that for their garden so i'm not entirely sure but these are for now going to go into the donation pile just on the off chance because we tend not to get gifted this many items unless it's to be donated out so i will put it with donations and if this is from any of you guys please do comment down below to let me know where you want these to go and we will make sure they get there okay thank you so much i'll put them on the floor down there my little puppy's just come to say hi. And there is also, oh my gosh, look at her. There is a doll. She is so pretty. Oh my gosh. Look, she comes with a little pair of shoes. She's got beautiful pink hair, beautiful pink eyes. Oh my gosh, she is lovely. Oh, she's so pretty. I really like her. She's really nice. Oh. And we have oh i know what this is because i've got one of these for my car but it's in pink so this is a seat belt cutter and a window basher basher so if you're in an accident and your car turns or whatever you take the cap off this bit here and there is a metal metal hammer and you can bash your way out through the window this 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 will break your window there is also i don't know if you can see there look there's like there's like a little bit that goes in there's a razor blade in that so if you get stuck you get it and you can saw through through your seat belt so yeah, there we go. These are for, for safety for your car. I have a pink one attached to the middle of my car at all times. They are so cool. That's a really cool thing to have. A very, very sensible thing to have as well in your car. Because you don't necessarily think anything's going to happen, but you never know. Got a little parcel here, which is cool. I actually don't know who this is from. I genuinely don't know who this is from. I don't know. Couldn't tell you. Like I said, people message me all the time saying we've sent you things and I don't remember. And I'd have to sit there with a book and like check list everything. So I'm really, really sorry to anybody who has actually messaged me previously saying we're going to send you all these things because I do actually, especially from Old Fart, he sends me so many things like like he'll send me text messages with so many pictures saying, OK, I've ordered you this and this and this and this and this. And then I just forget because we do actually get a few parcels for both channels. So I really do apologise if you sent some it and I just don't remember because I'm a twat. Sorry. Ooh. Okay, so we've got a bit of cord there. Oh, wow, okay. So there's a bit of cord and there is a sun catcher. Oh my gosh, look at that. It's beautiful. That is going to cast some serious rainbows. That is gorgeous. And it's kite shaped, which is really nice as well. Oh, that's so pretty and it's going to hang up. So thank you so much. I wonder if that's for Captain Corey's garden. Or maybe it's for Ostara's bedroom window. If it's from you, please comment down below. Like I said, if you if you see anything that I open and you guys want it to go somewhere specific, just tell me and I'll go and take it there. OK, it's not really an issue as long as it's not glass because I can't take glass to the cemetery. So um, don't send anything glass for Corey. But um, oh, my gosh. So we've got some more little glue on this thing's really strong. 
and it's well sticky like it's proper sticky glue is there some oh there's another one so there's another one this one's a different shape though oh no it's not it's not it's all so this is another one look so we've got another prism i'm wondering if there's a few of these actually because there's another one as well yep i can feel it there's another one in there as well and another one in there as well yeah so oh my gosh there's four of them which is incredible thank you so so much thank you that is brilliant thank you ever such a lot oh and another another seat belt cutter right i'm gonna need to find out who these are from where you want these to go who these are for because i want to make sure they go to the right people so thank you so so much and that is a few more items that's it right these things which have come here they are chihuahuas now that makes me think it could be from the old bar because he has a chihuahua himself and i've got a chihuahua called spooky so are these from you old fart i'm gonna have to message you and find out because they might not be but they look like they're glow in the dark chihuahuas which is pretty cool they're stickers who knows right okay so i'm gonna open these two little, little packets here I don't know who they're from and it's a shame because you can't actually get Timu to send um to send notes with things so you don't actually know who they're from okay so we've got three packets here and i can't open them they're so well glued together i'm gonna have to just cut them at the bottom i think make sure i'm not going to cut anything they're glued short so well it's unbelievable getting the right little, little pile of things here as well oh wow oh that is so pretty it's a tree of life oh my gosh how beautiful is that and it comes with like a beautiful little crystal oh my gosh that is stunning wow oh it's all wire work that is so pretty oh my goodness wow whoever sent that is oh my gosh thank you so much there's a, there's a little tiny love heart as well that says made with love on the bottom which is so pretty Oh my gosh, thank you. I love sparkly stuff like that, it's so nice. And there's another little one. I can see through these. I can't see what like what they are, but I can see I can see the shadows at the bottom, so I know it's safe to cut the packets. And here's oh there's another one. So this is in purple, the other one was green. There's a slightly shorter one. That is so so pretty. Look at that. Oh my gosh. It's purple amethyst, I think, isn't it? That is so pretty. Oh my gosh. And that one's just made with love as well. That, oh that is so pretty thank you and the another one which potentially is another another tree maybe it feels definitely feels the same weight and oh one in rainbow as well oh my gosh they are so pretty thank you so so much for those wow thank you Oh my god right so whoever has sent this please please contact me so i know where to send these are these for corey's resting place are these to donate out are these for bedroom windows are these for the memorial garden honestly please let me know because i want to make sure that obviously they go to the right places and obviously i i will fulfill all of your wishes so um with things like this not not like i'm a fucking genie like i will grant you 10 wishes or whatever no, like if you send something and you'd like it to go somewhere and I say something else on camera, please do correct me and let me know and I will take it to the place you want it to go to. But yes, we have two Chihuahua stickers. Like I said, I wonder if they're glow in the dark. I'm just going to hold it up against the light a second. And an absolutely beautiful, ornate, cut-out heart. Now I'm wondering if this is one of the ones that slightly twist. Because there might be. And I don't think it's actually... Yeah, I think it does because they're all they're all kind of like laser cut. Sometimes you can kind of position them so they, they, they all sit at like an angle. I was wondering if this is going to glow up. Is it going to glow up? Not at the moment anyway. No, but there we go. They are so pretty. Thank you so much. They're so cute. Oh my gosh. So yeah, I don't know who these are from. Legitimately have no clue. So please do tell me down below if this is from you. That'd be awesome. And thank you very, very much for your generosity. It's so cool have two more things to go two more and this one is spooky the puppy it's for you spooky hang on come on he's actually come to say hello come here spooks come here come on baby oh my god so he this is spooky the puppy <laughs> he's my little chihuahua he's about three months 
he's three months old something like that now and he's he's he just wants cuddles all the time look you're gonna say hi say hello hi spooky usually his, his ears are sticking up like great bat ears <laughs> you just don't wiggle bum hey are you okay oh he just wants cuddles like literally like all the time he's just he just snuggles up constantly all the time i'm allergic to dogs normally and i've got sprudels but i've never had a chihuahua i never wanted a chihuahua i thought they were rat dogs and i absolutely adore him he is just oh my god he's just the most loyal little companion and he's gentle with every member of the family not just me you're beautiful Yush, but I've got to carry on unboxing. I've got to unbox, baby, okay? Well, he's got a parcel. You've got a parcel. Let's put you on the floor, look. <laughs> okay, so this is to Spooky the Puppy, so he gets his own little fan mail, which is cute. People have sent him coats and jackets, and there's a really big parcel down here that I've still yet to, to open on video, and little papooses and everything. Stop playing with the, pa playing with the packaging. So thank you to everybody who sent things for Spooky as well, honestly, it's so cool. Oh my gosh, so this is a gift for you, for Spooky, enjoy your new three toys, love from Jennifer Tatman. Oh, hi, so I know who you are, hello, 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 oh my gosh, so, ah, look, she sent some toys. So we have a carrot, a rope ball, and a long rope as well, which is, oh my god, he's going to love these, see if I can open them. And they don't squeak, so thank you so much. So I'm gonna give him the carrot because he actually likes it. Yeah, spooks. What's this look? What's this? What is it? What's that? What is it? You got a carrot. What is it? You got a carrot. Hey. Oh, put it down there for him. Go on. Oh, I, I put it on the floor and he just leapt out my arms. Yeah, he's run off with it. He's run off with the carrot. It is a success. He likes the carrot. Thank you so much for sending him that, honestly. Uh, thank you, everybody, for sending him toys. Like, he loves it. He's not so fond of wearing clothes, but I still make him do it after his bath because it keeps him warm. But thank you so much. Yeah, honestly, all freaking legends. Okay, so the last one here is a parcel I can't even show you because it's come from abroad and they're shipping things on both sides. So this has come from, this is from Sandra Gibson and um, she is from Texas, I think. It says from Mansfield. So we have, there's a town called Mansfield, which is really close to where I live as well. But this says TX, which I think is Texas. And this is the, the two to the crap goth which is super, super exciting. So this is the last one of this unboxing video. And it's, oh my gosh, I love things that come through to the YouTube channels. And when it's from abroad, it's so exciting. It's amazing. Thank you so much. I just want to get this open now. I also keep the packaging. Even if it's really big, I keep the packaging from abroad because I just think it's such a cool thing to do. So thank you so much. Oh my god. Oh, it's all clearly wrapped as well. Oh my gosh. Can I show you this bit without showing you any addresses? How nice is that? Can you see the stars and stuff? It's really nice. Oh, really quickly actually, while we're on the subject of international parcels, if any of you guys do, do want, want to send anything and you send it through through the PO box, um, there should be some kind of like customs form on the top of it, on, on like the actual parcel. If you can tick it as being a gift, then that'll be amazing because it means we don't get charged anything for customs. Um, if it's a gift, if it's not ticked as being a gift, then we do get charged customs and sometimes it's well over £100. And then we have to take it from the Captain Cory Foundation, which we don't really like, like doing. So we love, 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 love things being sent to us. Honestly, thank you so much. But we, we, do, we just don't want to get stung for, like, for customs and stuff because that can be a bit shit. <laughs> oh my God, oh gosh. Oh my gosh, this looks like Christmas. Thank you so much. Wow, there's loads and loads of pink things in here. Okay, oh, and there's a letter. It says Pixie, which is cool. Oh my gosh, that's a really cool sticker. All right, I just have to say, I'm shit at reading people's writing, so I'm really sorry if I get this wrong. So this was on the February the 17th, and we are now on March. Are we in March? Yeah, March the 14th, I think it is at the moment. So this says, Dear Pixie, you've said you love journals, and I know you love Harry Potter. Oh my God, I do. I hope you enjoy this. If it's, if it's a do... If it's a double of what you already have, feel free to donate it. The stickers are for Ostara. Oh my gosh, thank you. The boots came in grey and pink, but I picked your favourite colour because I know Spooky won't care. Love and Light from Texas. I think it's from Texas. It says TX. 
there we go oh my gosh and the little stickers that's really cute so my favorite color is pink and my dog wears a lot of pink because yeah like you said he doesn't know what color he's wearing but we have some little unicorn serviettes or napkins which are really really cute they're like party napkins and actual fact we can use these for little tea parties we have with astara which is really cool oh my gosh so they are beautiful thank you so so much so they are going to be saved for astara because she loves having tea parties put those there oh my gosh and <gasps> i love the way everything's wrapped in little little paper it's so cute thank you and this oh squish squishing with my squad oh my gosh squash and it's our oh, star loves squish mallows and she has loads of them so she has the big ones and she has little ones all on her bed she loves them and she has squish fill houses which are like little soft houses made of fabric and little teeny 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 tiny ones look at that oh my god that is so cute oh my god she is gonna love that look at all the it's just full of stickers the whole thing is just loads and loads and loads of stickers oh, thank you that is a thousand a thousand stickers in there thank you so so much she's absolutely gonna love that thank you oh i love the fact it's like really shiny too that's really nice thank you so much you wrapped it up so beautifully as well taking so much care over this thank you you are shitting me seriously the cutest things I have literally ever seen for a dog ever don't ask me why I go so high pitch when I get excited but oh pet rain boots I think Spooky is going to kick my ass for putting him in boots but I am literally going to do it even if he only keeps them on for like five minutes I, I am just what I just need to get a picture of him or at least a TikTok video for 60 seconds of him going because you've ever seen dogs in boots if you've never seen dogs in boots get yourself onto youtube type it in it's absolutely hilarious look at those oh my god they are little pink rain boots for chihuahuas oh my god they are seriously adorable i i genuinely don't think he's going to keep them on <laughs> but I, i'm definitely going to give it a go just for the funny factor if he gets distressed i will take them off but they are so cute oh my god thank you so much I've actually I've seen boots on videos but I've never actually seen any like properly I love them thank you though my literally like my face is hurting from smiling so I think they are so cool thank you oh my god it's hilarious <gasps> happy little Astara oh my god it's rarity so it's rainbow uh, rainbow it's rainbow at all it's my little pony rarity oh my gosh so she is awesome there we go she's magic this one she's awesome and she could do magic with a horn she's really cool oh thank you so much so ostara does actually collect my little pony she's got quite a lot of them as well so she has oh my she'd be so excited thank you so much it's brilliant i still got my original my little pony stuff as well like it like from like the 1980 1983 ish i think and they're all upstairs which is cool and i bought a my little pony dream castle off one of my friends ages ago because it's just so awesome so have any of you guys still got like original toys like my original ones are loads and loads of rainbow brights teddy rookspin um flower fairies from hornby um obviously care bears and my little ponies so yeah i've got quite a lot on oh, popples wuzzles Polly Pockets. I, I collect vintage toys. So uh, do you guys collect anything like that? Please comment down below as well. We can compare collections. But that is amazing. Thank you so much. She will love that. And the last thing to open on this is this one, which is cool. It's wrapped up so beautifully. I'm loving the washi tape, by the way. Like I use washi tape on pencils and all sorts on the, and on the edges of shelves to make it look pretty. That is so nice. Oh my gosh. It's exciting. I don't have this. I don't have it. No. Oh my gosh. I love it. I love it. Oh my god. So I am a Potterhead. I am in Slytherin House. I absolutely love it. I don't know if you guys are aware of this. But it's definitely here. Um, I'm not going to say it too loud because it'll start. But on Alexa, you can do the Harry Potter quiz. You can do it every day. And uh, they give you three questions. And if you get all three right, you get a bonus question. Yeah. And you have to play it for at least three days in the month to be able to place in the world. And I was 3,500. I was in the top 3,500 and I've just been demoted to 4,500 because I keep getting the questions wrong. 
but yeah this is amazing oh my gosh so this is a di a light up diary set it includes a light up diary two sticker sheets and a topper pen oh my gosh watch the footprints light up and walk around that sounds so cool oh my god thank you so much and we have the Marauders map in there as well. And for those of you who don't know, I have just come back from London when I went on the Harry Potter studio tour and I did about a two hour video, including flying on broomsticks, watching cauldrons being stirred, the whole walkthrough of the London's tour. It was amazing. Honestly, I just wanted to stay there forever. But this is amazing. Thank you. I love Harry Potter stuff and I don't have it. So thank you so, so, so much for that. Oh my god, you're awesome, thank you. Okay, I'm going to finish there because I am absolutely exhausted. It is quarter to two in the morning, I have been talking non-stop for hours. And honestly, I just want to say a massive thank you to all of you. Like Honestly, like without you, none of this would be possible. You help to keep the channel going. Guess what as well, I've just seen I've got another box. So I'm going to carry on talking for another couple of minutes. But yeah, I'm just going to say honestly, like honestly, if it wasn't for you guys keeping this the channel going and sending things in for me to do videos like this none of this would be possible like captain corey started everything off with his youtube channel and he was my biggest advocate for this one so thank you so much and i am just going to grab this box it's literally like this big how can i miss it i think it's because i've got captain corey's things down here as well because i'm ready to do another youtube video straight after this one so this one, look, I'm gonna open this up. This is the last one. Oh my gosh. Seriously, you guys are awesome. It's like Christmas all the time in this house, which is brilliant. I nearly sat on my scissors. Can you imagine if I got that up my ass? That would hurt so bad. So this is to Pixie Winter, Travis Tavell, which is me, to my home address. I don't think I've ordered anything, so I'm thinking it's, oh, a gift bag. It's a gift bag, it's a gift bag, it's a gift bag. Oh my God. Oh my god, that's exciting, isn't it? <gasps> this one, two, no, three. Oh my god, there's three items in this. I'm going to do the big one last. Do the medium one, little one. Oh my gosh, and I always keep all of these as well. Oh, this is exciting. Thank you so much. So this is, oh my god, Miranda, again, thank you. Hi, Bab. I've sent with lots of love and massive rummy hugs from Miranda Stokes G. Oh, my God. Right, I have done about three videos and you have been in all of them so far. And she's from Birmingham, so she's not far from where I live. Like an hour, maybe, which is really cool. So I'm just going to try and get this ribbon open because they knot them quite well. My hair is just... It's going awful, like, like, like I'm starting to get tired. Like, you can see my eyes are like piss holes in the snow. Like, I'm getting, like really tired. This is, oh my God. So I put these on the Amazon wish list. <gasps> Thank you so much. Cause that means I don't have to use big cumbersome blunt scissors. These are little tiny bladed cutters for literally this reason for unopening. Oh my God. I can't even open the packet because I'm thick. Right. So look, there we go. So they are little cloud shapes and you just push up the levers and then a razor blade comes out the top basically. And they're literally for unboxing videos because, oh my God, trying to hold scissors that are just blunt is a nightmare. These are amazing. And I put these on the Amazon wish list literally to do things like this. So thank you so much. And I'm going to keep them well away from a star, don't worry. And they're beautiful. Thank you ever such a lot. Honestly, you legend. I'm going to use the pink one first because that's my favourite colour. Thank you, you are a star. And the second one is, I might, might say the same thing. Yeah, it does say the same thing, but I'm still gonna keep all of the tags. Goth ribbon! I need, I need to get my hair done, seriously. I'm getting my roots big time. Okay, this one is, what is this? Wow, oh my gosh, LED solar lights. Oh, thank you so much. These are gonna make things look so pretty in the garden. Oh my God, thank you so, so much. Auto on off, solar energy, waterproof, and eight lighting modes. Oh, they are awesome. Thank you so much, Miranda. Love LED lights, absolutely love things to go in the garden because it looks so pretty. Or if you want these to go to Corey, let me know and I'll take them to Corey instead. But oh my gosh, thank you so much. 
at the moment because we haven't had we haven't got the garden done yet Corey's bedroom is so full of things at the moment like it's full of things for his, his garden and it's gonna be amazing and Miranda actually bought him a bridge like 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 a, a proper beautiful garden bridge it's not one you can walk across it's like decorative but yeah I'm, I'm sure it was you Miranda wasn't it who bought it for him but it's gonna be so beautiful thank you so much for that put everything behind me and the last thing to be opened is this one <gasps> what is it it's very lightweight what is it okay so does the label say the same thing i think it might do yep it does thank you very much oh we've got all the potters the potter ribbons now <gasps> oh my god oh this is fantastic this is also off the amazon wish list wow and it's a bag that's got handles as well. I've literally never seen them in this country before, ever. It's so bizarre. This is, oh my God, this is brilliant. I put this down for the Captain Cory Foundation on the Amazon wish list. This is, as you can see, it is a clipboard, which is fantastic, but not, not, not only that, I'm not gonna open it all up now, but it's a clipboard, which is fantastic. And it's got a little groove down there for my pen, if it's flat on the table, which is brilliant. But it's also, you can open it up and you can store, you can store things inside. This I put on the Amazon wishlist purposely for the reason of the Captain Cory Foundation because over summer I fully intend to try and, and stand with stalls with um, organ donation um, kind of like information leaflets and because the UK is an opt out system but the rest of the world it still isn't. Um, but I would really, really like to offer um, information about organ donation and, and how it can help people. Um, also about Corey as well and his story just to help other people. And it's basically just to get kind of signatures and um, to also help with children's mental health, which I think there is a huge deficit in any kind of help for, for, for mental health anyway, but especially for children who have come out of hospital after suffering with long-term conditions and there just isn't the help there. Like there wasn't for Corey, like he had to wait for such a long time to get any help. And right at the end when he passed away, we were on our own. There was no help for us at all. Like not from palliative care services properly, nothing. And I think that's wrong. So I am going to be hopefully changing things as well. So this will be for petitions, information leaflets and everything. So thank you so, so much. It helps to keep them waterproof when I'm walking around. So this is for the foundation. Thank you so, so much. Absolutely brilliant. And on that note, I am literally going to go now. So thank you all so much for being so fucking amazing. I shouldn't really swear that much. I swear a lot. I'm so sorry. Thank you for being so amazing <laughs> like it's massively appreciated honestly like everything is just freaking wonderful and i couldn't do this without you so yeah i'm gonna shut up now because i'm knackered and i'm rambling and i bet you're pissed off with the sound of my voice so for everybody who sent things thank you so much again if you've seen something you've bought but i haven't said thank you like because i don't know who you are please please pop a message down below and i will hopefully um see it and say a massive thank you and let me know whereabouts you want me, you want me to put the things as well so all of you are freaking amazing love you lots thank you for sticking with me and i'll see you again soon bye, -bye. maybe i shouldn't film for crack in the box next because it's two o'clock in the morning and i'm knackered and i look like shit oh i think i might need a facelift what do you reckon right i'm going to bed now <laughs> good night bye thank you